All right, you guys, so I am on my iPhone right now and I'm gonna go ahead and open the app called Slow Shutter Fast Cam. And it's gonna take me, the first time you open it, it might give you like a buy it now kind of thing. You can just hit the X and it's gonna end up looking something like this. So I'm in my backyard. I have a fountain in my yard and I'm gonna go ahead and capture the motion of the water that is dripping down my fountain and try to blur the water. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this up by clicking in the left-hand corner with the eyeball. And then I'm gonna go ahead and have the capture mode be automatic so I don't have to fuss with color. And then I'm gonna have it, the shutter speed go for a full four seconds. And then I'm not gonna zoom in, I'm gonna have autofocus on. All right, now I just have to set up and compose my shot. So I'm gonna get kind of closer. You have to stabilize your picture on something because for four seconds, if you hold the camera in your hand, then what's gonna end up happening is you're gonna get motion blur just from wiggling your camera like sh camera shake. All right, so it has to be stabilized. So either an eye, uh, some kind of a, like makeshift um, tripod works great. I actually just have a little table I'm gonna lean on and hold really, really still and hope for the best. So here we go, I just go ahead and stabilize and then I hit the actual camera icon in the middle. It's gonna record the shot and then I can go ahead and hit save by just hitting the arrow here and you can swipe through and decide, uh, oh no, I'm just gonna go ahead and slow camera would like to add this to your photos. You just, it was the middle purple button that's like a, a disc, you just hit okay and it go ahead and saves it for you and that's it and then you can edit it.